if you see that your fear is that deep, here's a cool thing. Bring in the law of polarity. We've talked about that, right? Like the fear is there on the opposite. The law of polarity says that the opposite exists in the same time at the same place. So your courage is also there. Courage is the antidote to fear. So in just how layered, you're just, you're just focused on the problem side of it rather than the solution side. So I want you to just focus on the courage. So let's continue with this. I'm aware of being both overprotected from failure and sharply criticized. So what's the truth in that? Failure is part of the journey. So that's just about, you know, dealing with your own perfectionism, the, the need to do it right. And a lot of people have this wound deeply. I have had it deeply. It still pops up. And I'm like, why am I stuck on this? I'm like, oh, it's because I'm afraid of doing it wrong. I'm afraid of being criticized. <laughs> but, you know, it's just like, um, I, I've probably shared uh, a bit of this book, Addiction to Perfection by Marion Woodman where the, if the parent is always like, here's how to do it, and they're sort of like hovering over you, you never get to learn that you write your name upside down and spell it backwards, like that's okay. We need to go through those failures. And it's, it's, it's you know, a lot, it, you, you didn't come out um, dancing perfectly from the womb, you know? It's just like, there was, and I, I know this question is coming from a person who has danced, like, just notice how many times you had to go through that process of failing in, in learning something. The reason that criticism feels so scary is because usually the criticism in the past meant you may have lost the love of someone who is your protector or the person who's supposed to feed you. And the child is just like, I did it wrong. Like, you know, it's kind of like the sideways eyes. You're kind of like looking out, you're on alert. Um, and so it's like, how do I keep doing it right? Well, do it exactly how mom said to do it or do it exactly how dad said to do it. But then you never learn your own way to do it. And the only way you build that confidence is if you do it and you fail and you do it and you succeed. And you realize that in either situation, you're safe.